This is a relaxation exercise. This is where you really want the dog to just chill out, be relaxed, not worry about anything. Uh, sort of like you go, you know, sitting in the park and just watching life go by and not thinking about anything. So for this exercise, what you're going to do is have him on leash. You're also going to put your foot on the leash so that he can lie down comfortably, but if he chooses not to, he can get up, but he can't move very far. You specifically, because he's on leash, don't want him going around behind you and knocking you over. You too want to be totally relaxed, um, so quiet, deep breathing, a quiet voice, so you are transmitting to the dog, all is well with the world, and we're just going to chill here. When you're doing this exercise, it doesn't matter how well trained your dog is, we are not going to tell him what to do, we are not going to cue a behavior, we are not going to mark a behavior of any kind. For example, if you tell your dog to down and he downs and you say yes, or you use a clicker, or whatever you do, we're not going to do anything like that. We are just simply going to lure him into the position and then quietly reinforce him for being in that position. You're going to have 15 pieces of food, nice and handy for you, and you're going to lure your dog down. And you know when he does go down, you can not have to say anything to him at all. So we're going to lure him into the position. Do not speak to him, just quietly do that. Give him the treat. And you're quietly going to deliver another treat. Now you've got 15 pieces here. You are going to use the first 10 just by quietly doing this. If you can drop it to him, do that. You know, so that you're just quietly breathing deeply. You are silent. You are relaxed. You are breathing quietly. That was 10 pieces. Now you're going to stop and just wait for a moment to see what he does. If he chooses to get up, move away, that's fine. Um, this is the first step of this exercise training, and so we're just going to allow him to just get up. Then we'll just try it again at another point in time. If he remains in this position, you're going to give him another five pieces. Again, quietly. I'm going to try not to toss it because that may get him excited waiting for it. We're going to do the five pieces of food. Quincy is not relaxed. Even though he's lying over on one hip, he's still eagerly waiting for these treats that I'm going to give him. And when you are done with that, what you're going to do is release him and toss a piece of food. Okay, and toss the piece of food. And that is the end of step one. Step two is simply to repeat this exercise three more times. And you might want to take it to a different area. You want to start over again. Uh, and it will depend on the dog. If there are distractions, that's fine. If they are too distracting, uh, he's just anxiously trying to get at something. Increase your distance. Just leave. Don't bother doing it there. We never say anything to the dog. We never reprimand the dog. It is all up to the dog to decide what he wants to do.